Hello everyone, said here back again with another video. In this video, we are going to discuss about Tini MCE. So, how you can integrate Tini MCE in Laravel 8? Okay, so here we have the already installed. Um, this is my profile basically. I have a multiple account here. So, you can uh, you need to first of all you need to configure, uh, you need to put your ID and password something. So, let me show you how you can. I'm going to open the Tini MCE in incognito mode. Just go inside of the tiny mc profile and just you need to sign up uh, click on sign up button and you create your account so might be i have already so i, I don't need to do anything so i will put my id and password so just create your account and put id and password once your id and password configured then you need to go in, inside of the dashboard let me show you uh, you need to go inside of the dashboard and then you need to put your uh, account informations like I have the ABI key and you need to put this kind of things okay so now how you can integrate I have already added here so you can check tiny MC in URL and we have this uh, this text editor and let me show you so we have added here uh, we have the bootstrap file and we have the text area here inside the container let me minimize this one now check we have here text area and we have added some script which is provided by the boat step so we can put also this is a best practice to putting in body part okay so we have added here now we have the text area and we are putting the welcome to mtn mc you can remove this one and uh, let me refresh the page you can check and if you want to put any anything you can put like this one welcome to real programmer so so you can write any kind things whatever you want so how you can integrate i am going to show you step by step okay so first of all uh, i am going to use bootstrap form so it's really e easy for me so i don't want to write a lot of code in HTML part so let me create the first of all any file so just go in resource view folder and put any file name so I'm going to use as a test dot blade dot PHP once I have created file then I need to put uh, this stuff let me write here HTML file something Laravel tiny MCE okay so and then we need to put here some uh, bootstrap file first of all we need to add this one let me put here okay we have the CSS part and now we need to put JS part okay so this is jQuery and second one is bootstrap JS so I'm going to put here once we have added so I'm going to create here one div this div will I will create one container okay and container so we have this stuff now I am going to put here text area okay when we don't need to write a lot of things here let me put that like this one now we need to put here uh, after this tag uh, any MC code basically okay so let me Put this one the script in MCE and we have added test so I'm going to here I'm going to load this page okay so let me write the code here we have the test I'm going to write as a test let me show you now we have the test yes this is not working why this is not working let me show you we have done any wrong things might be let me see sorry we have forget this one okay we need to write here after this tag and let me refresh the page 
now this is working fine so hope so this is clear and uh, also uh, if you have any doubt related to this video please let me know so i will create another video thank you for watching this video